I'm Reverend Msusa, BTS of my single district. Um, I've been here for the past six years. I'm serving my sixth year and probably the bishop may give me the two more years, I'm not very sure. We have got a very big church here. My district is composed particularly with uh, uh, 16 congregations, 16 church conferences, churches. And um, this one, uh, Nyangambe, is under Chirezi circuit. We are hoping that it is going to grow as we have started very well, particularly we started with 16 people in the first, first service and it's grown up to uh, 80. It is our hope in the next, by the end of the year, it will be a very good, uh, big uh, congregation. Beside this one, we have got other congregations that are scattered around the, the, the rural area. Uh, we do have that, the other one is in Saka, where there is a, there is a need of a personage and uh, in the sanctuary. The other one is in Chirumans up in Mashingo and the northern part of Mashingo where there is need uh, there is a need of uh, a personage. Uh, we have also event circuits. Uh, normally these event circuits are not very big. The majority of them they range from 300 to 400 and some of them even less. But they are doing wonders because they can support my, my, my office, they can support other ministerial projects like evangelism, revivals, so they were doing very well. But we would need also some kind of support, particularly in the building projects, because that's where we cannot do much. We can bring people to Christ, we can um, bring people to the, to, to the church, but we cannot provide, considering um, uh, the resources that we have, we will not be in a position to provide uh, something like sanctuaries. And personages, so that, that's why we need probably uh, help from other from our partners. Um, uh, I think that's all. Okay, and how did uh, the relationship with Gulf Breeze and uh, the appointment of Gulf Breeze? Uh, uh, it originated. Uh, I think Austin can help me. This okay. now should be three years or so. I'm not sure. Huh? We started about three years ago. Yeah, about three years. But the last year, that's when we signed our contracts, our partnership contract. Mm -hmm. And before the bishop, he signed it, and we thought probably it was not going to materialize because we only have a paper. But now we are seeing the fruits of the partnership. Mm -hmm. Everything is coming and it's just coming into. Uh, it's reality. now happening into it's reality. A reality. Yeah, it's coming into a reality. It's now happening. It's like uh, to me, it's just like a dream. Whatever the pastor is doing to me, to, 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 to this congregation, is just like a dream. I wasn't even expecting that by now we'll be having such a kind of a congregation. It's just, well, it's just marvelous. And that helped solidify the appointment yes. of Reverend Vincent uh, uh, yes. to the Actually, church. What, here. what happened when we sat with the cabinet? People were not up. They were not ready to, 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 to appoint a pastor to, to this congregation. But after a long discussion, we agreed that the was right. So we tried and it's, it's, it's happening. We are seeing wonders. And Vincent, share a little bit about the congregation and the church here already in Nagambi. Well, yeah, the congregation here at Nagambi is growing. Uh, by the first day we started... Uh, by the first day we started the uh, year, uh, we we spent about uh, two weeks without any uh, attendance for, for for the church services on Sundays. So after uh, every day uh, for the first two weeks, uh, we were me and my wife we were visiting people door to door, uh, evangelizing to them. Uh, after that, uh, on the twentieth of January. Uh, we started our first service, and we att we had uh, 60, the attendance was 16 uh, people attended the, the services, and we continued with the, those visits. On the second Sunday, we were 34. The third Sunday, uh, the numbers uh, rose to 52. The fourth one to 57. Uh, the fifth one to 62. Uh, and uh, as from there, our numbers were now 54. 52, 54, and the latest Sunday uh, 
at our church here in Yangambe, we were eight. So the congregation is uh, is rising by uh, by day.